Hey what's up guys and welcome back to another video so this will be a quick update video on Solana as you can see we are currently breaking down from this previous support area right here around 166 dollars and I was already mentioning in one of my last videos like like you can see right here I marked this area already and I was mentioning that if we are start closing some candles below this support area right here so this would be somewhere around 165 dollars we will uh, sell off most likely to retest this support area at 155 dollars again guys so if you take a look you can see that exactly this scenario scenario is playing out right now and we are currently seeing this huge red candle if you take a look right here guys and we uh, i think we will retest most likely in the next one or two four hour candles guys this area right here at about 155 dollars so the problem right now that I that I'm seeing is we will we are building right now head and, and head and shoulders pattern in the four hour time frame. If you take a look, we have here the left shoulder guys in the four hour time frame. Right here we have the head, and then we would have right here the head uh, the right shoulder, and that would be quite bearish in the immediate short term for Solana guys. And I think if we cannot hold this support area in the next hours at about one hundred and fifty five dollars, and we start closing some candles below it. So this would be somewhere around um, $153. Then my next demand zone and what I would be looking out for for Solana right now would be first of all this yellow trend line right here. And then uh, and this would be somewhere around $147, guys. Because if you take a look at the 4-hour time frame, guys, you can see that since we found some support right here at about $115, We've been trading since then in this huge uptrend right here and we've been making higher lows since then in the four hour time frame and we are still holding this uptrend in the four hour time frame guys and that's why i think like i already said if you're selling off to this support area at about 156 dollars and we cannot and we cannot hold this support right here then i'm i'm expecting a retest of this yellow trend line right here and this would be somewhere around 147 to about 150 to about 150 dollars guys so otherwise if we can uh, close in the next four to eight hours some strong four hour candles again above this uh, previous top right here uh, so this would be somewhere around 170 to about 173 dollars if we can start and then if we can close in the next hours some green four hour candles in this price range right here then i think we should take out this previous top right here about 177 dollars first of all and if we can take it out and if you if we will see a confirmed breakout in the next hours guys then i think and of course we have first of all to close some strong four hour candles above this previous top right here then i think my next target would be this previous resistance right here at about 195 dollars guys because if you take a look you can see from the past price action we've been rejected really hard at this area right here at about 193 dollars and since we've been not able to break this resistance right here we've been selling off since then back to about 115 dollars guys so yeah like i already said if we can close some strong four hour candles in the next hours above this area at about 175 dollars i think we will trade most likely in the next one or two days maybe back at this range at about 175 to about 195 dollars and if we cannot hold this support area at $155 in the next hours, I'm expecting a retest of this area at about $147 to about $150, guys. For all of you who want to make a long trade in the next 4 to 8 hours, I would consider to make a long trade from this support area at about $155, guys, with a take profit target of approximately $174 and a risk reward ratio, a risk reward of about. Um, and the stop loss of about $150, guys. So I would have a risk reward ratio, as you can see right here, of about 1 to 3, guys. So this is definitely a very good trade to take, in my opinion. Then I would enter my long trade right here with the retest of this previous support area right here. Scale out 50% of my position size at this backholder area at about $166. And then, of course, I would scale out 100% of my position size at this previous top right here at about $174, guys. So this is my game plan for Solana in the next 4 to 8 hours guys watch out if you can hold this support area right here if not I'm expecting a sell off to retest this yellow trend line right here otherwise if we start closing some strong 4 hour candles in the next hours above this previous top right here I think we will uh, retest this uh, 
range right here between 173 to about 195 dollars again so this was the quick update for solana guys if you enjoyed the video please drop a like subscribe to my channel if you have any questions just comment down below and hope i'll see you next video thank you for watching guys bye bye